Well, all right, everybody. Good evening, and welcome to the House Beyond Supernatural podcast. The podcast goes beyond supernatural. All music comes from verse thirteen, Shadow Symphony, and public domain. All printing for this podcast is provided by the Rainbow Press of Omaha, Nebraska. For more details about this podcast, you can be found at houseofbts.net. Tonight's cast includes John the Genius, an archaeologist, played by Ani. Peter the Peck, psychologist, played by Nick. Cast psychic medium and astrophysicist, played by Cook. Zia, the physical psychic and extreme athlete, played by Shannon. And the host of the House of BTS as the Game Master, Steve. Get set and get in the character. It is time to go beyond the supernatural. I need to go really quick. Because last we left off, uh, the group. Four. Two. Sun had set. The, the group is heading back with uh, with the uh, with the oddball filled uh, with a, with a, with several handfuls of berries, which means he needs a different light source to see his way in the dark. Just dump the berries out. Sorry, John. You gotta lick them up off the floor. Gross. We have we brought and our phones, till, right? He'll he'll be thankful for some uh, dirt on it. Being a slave to the dice, I am uh, I am pleased to let you all know that there uh, there was no further distractions between here and getting back to the pavilion. So the firelight coming from the pit inside the pavilion is warm and inviting in this cold rain and helps guide your way back. And just as you exit the tree line and are within a few hundred feet of the pavilion, a scream of sheer pain. <laughs> A scream of sheer pain and terror cuts through the cold night air. Oh, do I need to do it again? No, no, no please don't. You will, you might, you probably would have, but the screaming stops dead, followed by a second scream of horror and the sound of shotgun blasts, <laughs> accompanied by flashes of light within the pavilion. He is gonna run in. Knife drawn. Alright, I'm gonna arm myself with my Beretta. I hear knife drawn, armed with a Beretta. The whip of my sweet, sweet annihilator super. He's gonna do some close close I encounter really wet to. work. Well, the three of you arming yourselves with the whether it be your hammer, your uh, beretta, or your knife. Climbing the first few steps to uh, to look into the doorway, John lies dead on the floor. His entire abdomen nothing more than a gaping hole, blood and gore clutters the floor around him. I need all three of you to attempt a horror factor of 16 or better. Oh, oh man. <laughs> <laughs> yes! I got 16 right on. 19! I, I rolled a 2 for a 4. We got a 19. So you two, strangely enough, uh, you succeeded with... I didn't, talk a big I talk. <laughs> yes, you, yes, you do. Well, Zia, you stare in absolute horror and disgust as dozens of little merman-like creatures are seen nearby John, rapidly expanding and growing to toddler-sized and beyond as they attack and consume each other. Zane stands only a few feet beyond them, looking on with a sense of fear and horror as you've never seen them before. The bigger creatures rip apart and gobble up the little ones until only seven remain, growing to five feet tall within a matter of 15 seconds. One of them runs in the opposite direction of the doorway the group is standing in, fleeing the pavilion, while the others form a sort of wall between her and the group, standing in a position that says they're ready to attack. With tears in his eyes, Zane begins reloading his shotgun, his expression of fear and shock turning to anger. All right, Honor, uh, Arnie. Well, as it's obvious now, John is dead, and yet his children live. And you are going to play out this next scene on the children's behalf. I am controlling the six sons of John. I hate these things. Sorry, John. Sorry, John. You were too late. So, what's the effect of me failing the horror factor? Murder. Shit bar. your pants. Well, that's a Murder. given. <laughs> until the uh, until the next time we have a basically a resting scene, if you will, or a scene to catch your collectiveness, you are minus one on all your future horror factor saves. Oh. I was hoping maybe some combat penalties. Well, there is that because they still have to do a horror factor against uh, the, uh, the 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 babies the first round. <laughs> so like, we're not there yet. And she will have a negative one against that. <laughs> no, the horror factor is just witnessing what's happening with you in the scene itself. But now we'll mm. have to deal with the supernatural creatures themselves. 
which always get a horror factor. So hang on. So, uh, so to all of the children, and I'm speaking to Arnie as I say this, I'm in a weird GM seat where I'm talking to the enemies and the, uh, the heroes in this one. The children are ready. Children, your sister calls out to all of you, oh. and you all understand on an instinctive level. Your sister must escape so she can create more. Nothing else matters but making more. You must protect her and, he and help her escape. Protect her with your life if you must. You must especially protect her from the woman who killed that woman. So three of them, in this case, are to gang up on Zia. The remainings are going after the others. How many are there? Six. Plan that includes the one that ran off. No, that does not. That would be that would be seven. 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 Number seven took off immediately. I want to f go after seven. Well, take the other three thing, with you. You sure. will have to do is to get through the uh, the creatures to do it as they stand between you and seven. And first things first, all of you will need to make a save uh, versus horror factor, and I believe it is thirteen versus twenty three. Thirteen because there's more than three. Twenty two. I got 10 with my negative one. 12. Well, I, I'm not going anywhere. One. I will be playing on Zane's behalf tonight. I, this is a, it's a weird night for uh, for me as well. Good, so, because I can't not be scared of everything right now. Well, yeah, you're not the only one. Yeah. Zane blows his own head off. Zane, <laughs> <laughs> Zane failed his horror factor uh, just the same as you did. Anyone else fail? I did. Nope. So Peter is the only one who kept his composure. Which means that, yes, uh, the first round of everybody except against Peter means that the, uh, the, 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 the children get the, uh, the first attack on them. Yeah. I'm going to take my helmet. I'm gonna... John, I'm so sorry, but I'm going to have to kick your kid's ass. Kick their asses. Round one action. Uh, round one action one goes to the children. Every, in everybody's case except uh, Peter, uh, all the, uh, the other three first action and only the pain. You think after all we've been through guys that you guys would be a little bit more oh, okay with this? I'm still getting over the fact that my friend died, man. Shut up. I am mad I did not kill him first. Attack. Each of these children have uh, it looks like you roll a D six for their attacks. Is that uh, how you have that set up or can I choose? I do it, um, when, when I'm when I'm GMing yeah I always All right. Um, so number one, two, and three will be going after Xena. Um, two of them are going to do leap attacks, and she seems so aggressive against the sister. And then one of them is going to be a little more conservative. So let's see. Let me mark these. A leaper, a leaper. So son number one will leap at you. Try to get their grubby little fish arms around you. Perry Come on. My K -bar. 20. I got a 14. 14. Right. And Avengers win on ties. The next one will leap! <laughs> 18. Uh, 2 plus 8, 10. Alright, this attack does no damage, but the little monster automatically grabs onto you and wraps its little arms and legs around you. <laughs> Unless it's pulled off or removed. It'll probably be biting at you, close to your neck. Well, that's number two. Then we have three, the third to worry about. Number three. Is he going to come up and, I don't know, just try to strike at you? Well, can I do anything since I'm grappled? Oh, yeah, I mean, just because you have these things clinging to you doesn't mean you can't still defend yourself from multiple attacks. Unnatural 20. Well, it, it's uh, it's going it, to... Uh, uh, claw attack. It miss probably. Uh, it got a four total. So I think it was a miss. That's yeah, yeah a natural right. uh, a four uh, a four altogether, even after bonuses or less, is always a miss. So those three are done. All right, sun number four is on Zeke. <laughs> I think he, I think he Zed? purposely. Zane. What's his name? Zane. 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 I'll write it down. Zane. <laughs> What are we going to do? We're going to do a leap attack. Oh, oh, fudge. <laughs> a natural one. All right. Zane is not impressed. <laughs> Son number five on Kirk. 
is going to try on who a claw on who Good. Yeah. on who job what's your guy's name is <laughs> <laughs> on job <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps it was a mistake letting Arnie handle his kids. <laughs> yes. That's the wrong dice. I'm so excited to kill the party. <laughs> a four. Man, my favorite white dice is really fucking me up. Now here's where I'm going to crit. I think your die is doing very well. Uh, son number six is uh, going to try for a claw attack on on Peter. God Damn it, wow. six. Eleven. <laughs> Actually, no, for personally, I love you, Die, right now. Time to switch up. <laughs> and you uh, you are the only one who actually has your first action to strike back with, Peter. I'm going to take, like, from the dodge or the parry of my hammer, I'm just going to bring it back and just smash it into the side of your head. Whack him with a hammer. <laughs> that was a nine. <laughs> Not even going to worry about it. Gonna take it. Oh, that's a ten. I'm armored. Weird dice. Yes, they do. Uh, these creatures do have armor rates that you have to uh, that you have to reach over to damage them. Otherwise, it does no damage to anything else. Every supernatural being usually has some sort of armor rate. Oh, weird dice. Yeah. Which one? Armor rating. Site. No, flip it. Yeah, you have down. armor rating 12 in set. Yeah, but you've got it rated at 14. Any attack less than 13 does no damage to anything else. Okay, wait. My parry plus my weapon parry is added for bonuses, armor right? Armor rating 12 is reading right on both sides. Oh, if it's 12, don't you have to hit a 13 or higher? That's, 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 but yeah, any attack less than 13 does no damage to anything else. Oh, oh sorry. Yeah, the less than is the key word. Sorry, I wasn't listening. So my weapon parry plus my regular parry gets all added together, or is it just my weapon? Yes, it's just your weapon. I believe it's just your weapon. Because... Uh, for example, yeah, like your uh, Kmart combat knife. You have a strike right here. This will represent both the strike that you will have here if you had it, as well as uh, what this one is. Oh, both okay. of these together should... Yeah, I, I then we're know. good. I'm doing it I right. Even noticed, yeah, it's hard to make it easy on you, but all that's right there for you. So don't have it. You can all try that. and make it easy on me, but there's a lot of numbers I'm, I'm on there. I'm doing my best here, all right? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. So my guys are fighting Rambo Tap. Pretty much. Uh, which that brings me to action two. And Children still has carry the initiative. All right, son number one did a double attack, so it can't go. And so the same, son number two did. Also a double attack. Leap attack is two attacks. So, sudden number three will try to slash at you again. A uh, natural one. <laughs> he cuts that his own neck. That is awesome, man. All right. Keep that rolling that one. Keep rolling, no, keep rolling that one. Keep rolling Going to sudden number four on Zane. We're going to do a... He can't do anything because he did a leap attack. Sudden <laughs> number five on Cass. Oh, stop, stop, stop. stop. Uh, Zane gets his attack that time. So this is a fine one. Good. Pretty good. I not get an attack. Back? You are welcome over there, Cass. I just saved your life. Thanks, all right, all right. Yeah. What about Zia? Did she get her attack? No. That's a fair point. She would have an attack from you, so she could try to pry number two off and just hope it one goes. Body slam both of them. I have body flip pro. Squash his head like spider. All right. The first thing you're gonna have to do before you can do a body flip like pro, uh, you're gonna need to. Uh, yeah, you're, you're, you're gonna both gonna need to do. A strength test for both of you. You're gonna roll your uh, your twenty sided. Add your strength attribute to us uh, to it. Highest number wins. Ready? I'm ready. Straight up strength. Straight up strength. But, uh, it's twenty eight. Do I even need to roll it? Yeah, you need to roll it. <laughs> well, yeah, you could roll a one and you could roll really seventeen high. plus twenty eight. Or that could happen. And what is your total? Sixty four. I don't know. <laughs> Mine's thirty six. Really? I seriously can't do this in my head. She can't math in her head. She can't math oh, at all. Oh, shit. 40 fucking 5. Yep. Really? Yes. <laughs> it is. See, I uh, can't even no, math on No, it is not. It is 35, so, yeah. 75? <laughs> 125! <laughs> See, yeah. 
I don't Roll care. Roll percentage dice? The hell did you do down there? <laughs> I am not yelling. I'm merely really commentating. Seven. Very even. Five, right? Thirty-five. Forty-five. 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 Oh, yeah, see? That's what I said the first time, right? <laughs> Jesus, I'm not a mathematician. So I, I didn't. We're Americans, and most of us went to public school. I did. <laughs> One, two. Hurry up! I want to kill Cass. Let's go. So you, you know, due to your having Sambo, so that automatic in this case does allow you to body flip throw him after you pried him off of your body. Can I roll my damage? Uh, you actually still have to roll the strike for it. Thank God! <laughs> you can't just, you know, do it successfully. You still have to attempt it. Nine plus my strike. Plus your strike. Fifteen. Which means that uh, he has to beat your, uh, your strike uh, to be able to uh, keep you from doing so. I will... Perry? No, it's it's a strike oh. roll versus. Oh, I will strike. Sixteen. <laughs> Only a fifteen. So you tried to uh, body flip throw, and he successfully kept you from doing so. But he's off me, right? But he is off of you, yes. Time to go. But that is your action. All right, see. Oh yeah. Zane was not fired. Said. Zebakaya. Zane. Let's see here. Don't think about it. Actually, yeah, memory series, I was going to give it. You gotta put your pants up first. Is there an ISP bonus for these little assholes? Yes. You're at times four. Thanks. Oh, uh, oh I'm sorry. You're times at times six. six. Both you and the, uh, actually, oh, yeah, you, Zane, and times Mark, six. six. Uh, I have all together a 13 for uh, the shotgun blast. Uh, that's convenient. Let me. It's, uh, they have an auto dodge. Uh, shotgun blast, huh? We better dodge that. A 19 to dodge. A shotgun blast. Alright, now you are at Cass. You may attempt to do the killing. Alright, Cass. Ah, oh, damn it. Eight to slash you. Twelve. Ah! Peter, this one's oh. going to bite you. <laughs> A seven. You have the awesomest GM dice I think I've ever seen. Nine. <clears throat> Motherfucker, that's Brooks Brothers. <laughs> wearing a Brooks Brothers suit. <laughs> oh, he is! <laughs> That's right. We're pulling out old blue. 18. He'll smash you in the face. I'll parry! Damn it, it hit me. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Bullshit. Three. Oh no! <laughs> it's gonna be a while. It's just like hacking you, like with a little hatchet. I can't hit you, so. <laughs> All right, that brings us to action three. Action three. We have three of these little bastards on you. Zena. Shit. <laughs> Zara. Zia. <laughs> Zia. You say enough Zia. Z names, eventually you're gonna get it. Zebra. <laughs> the Zima? first one. Just call me Za. Is going to bite. Yeah! 18. Take that, Zylone. 18. 8, 9, 10, 21. No! <laughs> the second one is going to try to claw. Yeah, seven. Uh, one. Yes! Oh! <laughs> You're pregnant. Your, You're you pregnant now. Do, do, do I got a seven total to hit. I don't know. I don't think so. I can repair her arm. Come on, box cut. Right, you have a point blank vest, so if you roll oh. 10 or less, he has to be straight single. Okay. Ah. Straight single. <laughs> well, 13 points off your vest. Okay. Off your vest. I think you had a 30 to hit. 
I do have a third one. Okay. And you're ready to use it. Sixteen to claw you. Fucking fuck one. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, your you armor. Jesus, I've had one. Fucking fuck. <laughs> this is going to your SDC. God, yeah, six points. <laughs> Arnie's enthusiasm, man, I'll tell you what. I've never heard of a guy so excited to kill his group in my life. Alright, so I'm going to do a telekinetic punch. <laughs> I'm going to pretend to be John. All my guys get like two dozen free attacks on you because you're trying to do an action. Damn it, that I broke something giving you the Rambo Tep treatment. To <laughs> a different John. No. Uh, yes, you do add in your strike bonus. Okay. Ten plus sixteen. Yes. Quit. Do they have an auto parry? I was assuming uh, they the did. Auto dodge. Uh, yeah, because they're instinctual, they do have auto dodge. Yes. What about parry? Um, they, yeah. Uh, okay. Every yeah, the, uh, and any generally any supernatural creature that has a parry bonus usually has an auto as well. Okay. If you're instinctual, you have auto dodge. Ones and twos? Uh, for your damage, yes. Ah! Yeah. Oh. Uh, 24. Wait, I, I gotta try to parry you. No! Take it! What did you, what did you roll? No, take it all! This first time, he will not be able to parry it because it's, uh, it's, it's a telekinetic. Take oh. it! Oh. It's, you know, I'll take it. How much damage? 24. To one, two, or three? Uh, I don't know. Whichever one's closest. Pick one. Two. Who was the one that did it? I think it was two. That, was, yeah, that one would probably be the closest. I want to punch number two. Punch the shit. All right. <laughs> Let's kill Zane. Heck yeah. We're going to do a cold shot to his throat with a claw attack. Holy crap. All right, cold shot to the throat. We're going to need a three. <laughs> well, I got a four with bonuses, so. To hit a neck, you will need a 15 or higher. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm not the one going at the neck. I wouldn't have hit with anything. <laughs> I was just explaining. This, and this is why I keep a game shield. Mm. Alright, alright. Firing again. What a dick. <laughs> what? <laughs> They're just children. Asshole children. <laughs> Yeah. Those little rat bastard kids were, you know, Scoop them up and spank them. Satan spawn. <laughs> I'm gonna take them over my knee. This is what you get for trying to eat me. No, we're not doing that. Come on, I'm ready to <laughs> dodge, baby. I'm, I'm sure you are. I'm uh, ready to dodge. I'm gonna uh, dodge this bitch. Watch this shit. 12. 13. <laughs> so take a 12 when they got past the armor rating anyway, unfortunately. But. There it is. Uh, that's just... All right, Cass, you ready for this? Power claw attack. Yeah, all right, not bad. I got a 14 for my power claw attack. I'm going to dodge. Gah! 19, buddy. Mm. Nice try. It'll take your, unfortunately, uh, dodging takes your next action, but you are not harmed. Oh! Said the wrong word. Go Going ahead. to PDAC. Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater, gonna get a fish stick in his butthole, and it's gonna be all nasty. <laughs> it's nice not being the vul vulgar one on the We're show gonna do tonight. a leap attack! Oh, 16. One. Yes! A leap attack does no damage, but automatically grabs onto you, wrapping its little arms and legs around you, putting its mouth in a position to bite you on the throat. Rubbing its little fist chubby against your chest. <laughs> However, you now that it is your action, you could try to quickly pry him off. What am I going to try to do? Or unless you have some other trick up your sleeve. <laughs> oh, you are. We don't have an armor rating for the helmet yet, so I'm not going to headbutt him with it. <laughs> oh, you should. Oh, 36. Can you do a 36? It's very 
down its throat. 36 and what? Oh, I thought we were doing a strength test. <laughs> <laughs> let's see. My st- oh, yeah, let's try it. Let's crit this bitch. Let's... You don't have to do a strength test. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> I just got an 18. Add it to your strength. Nine. Well, it's just a 28. <laughs> yeah. If I come back, I'm being your spirit guide. If I die, I'm coming back in spirit guide. Round four. I'm going to roll both my strengths. Yeah. I'm going to start leading the group here. El numero uno is going to do a restrained punch. Fuck it, I rolled it. A six to punch you limply. Fifteen total. You parried. And I officially well, take restrained punch off the list. Yeah. You done? No, number two. <laughs> His <laughs> claw. Oh, oh, 17. 17, that's over your armor. So, oh, what happened? What 15. happened? 15. Yes, a little more damage. We're wearing you down. Nine damage. <laughs> number three. Number three is going to try to uh, bite you. Oh, man. A four. All right. I rolled a one. Oh. <laughs> awesome. So biting is three points. However, you're bleeding now. To my vest or to Oh, SBC? I don't know. What did I roll? Yeah, what did you... I don't know. What did that roll? It was low. So your vest. Three points okay. to your vest. And I'm bleeding. Nope, no, nope, it just hit the vest. All right, feel free to attack one of them. I recommend number one, since you haven't damaged him. No, go for two. Go for two. I two. am going two. to desiccation touch whoever just fucking bit me. That would be number three. That's automatic. Probably overkill. If you're angry enough, you have to talk. 50. Oh my god, that thing is gone. <laughs> She's just That's gonna up. flip it off. <laughs> Fuck you. Daddy, help. <laughs> help me, daddy. Duh. Alright, let's kill Zeke. Piss her off. Zeke's is going to claw him. Yes. Yeah, 17. All together, I have a whopping 8. Yes! Not a good roll. Total party kill. That is uh, 8 8 damage. 8 damage. That's 8. Yes. Alright. Since it's done so great for me so far, I will continue firing with my other shot. All together, that one is uh, 17. Build attempt to dodge. Yeah, 19. Yeah. yeah, they're defensive. Yes, they are. They can't hit the broad side of a Russian wrestler, <laughs> but... <laughs> Pass. Right, Cass. Yours is out of actions. Mine's out. Yours is out of actions. And Yours is out of actions as well. Is it? Yes. Are we on the third action? You're on action four. four. Probably a lot stronger than I am. But... Oh, trying it again. What else are you going to do? Stick your hammer up its little butt? It's evil little I'm butt. Sorry, to... let's get this back into the creepy horror game genre. It's evil, disgusting, Take the spike into my hammer horrible little butt. And put it to the back of him, and I'm just going to run straight at a wall. It's going to dodge. <laughs> <laughs> He's holding on, and I'm running straight at a wall. It was a 19. Yeah. I have no idea what his options are. I would treat that, uh, you know, ultimately, if he understood what was happening, the only thing I could think of is, yeah, he could try a dodge, or he could, uh, or shit, he could try a... Uh, He's a fish. A simultaneous strike. Really, yeah, if, he, if he's running and he feels like he's still on, but he's running. Fuck it, you got him. <laughs> yeah, he's just, he's he just he can, he can staring at your juicy little throat. And since it's a running, it's like a little bit of power. So it's like a little bit of power. It's in the back. It's like this. Well, Oop. in the back is still a, a critical strike. So basically, your damage is going to be lower than the other one. Ooh. 28. Total? Anymore. I mean, it's kind of it's, disappointing. It's compared all I got. to 50. <laughs> well, that's kind of an unfair comparison. Desiccation touch is meant to be kind of. That was a shit roll, too. 
Yeah, so I, I can't hit a damn thing with a shotgun. I haven't taken a pot shot at mine yet. All right, anybody got five attacks? I do. Uh, yes, five, five attacks. Zeke doesn't count. <laughs> Somebody should look to see if John had a gun on him. Zeke he ever did. I don't Spend need a that gun. attack to look for a gun. No, I am going to do one more telekinetic punch at whoever's closest to me. So, ten. How do those work? Oh. Do I get to do ten? I'm sorry, what? Telekinetic punch, how did it work? Uh, well, the first thing it did not make the armor, if that counts. No, if it didn't make the armor, it doesn't matter. It ultimately, uh-huh. telekinetic punch, if the, if the target knows and understands what it is, they can attempt to dodge it. An opponent may try to dodge or parry as usual. But the armor means nothing happened anyway. But yeah, the armor yeah. rating does So matter. sorry. Wait, the armor rating doesn't matter? Or no, the, no, the attack? Yeah, I mean, okay, all right. The, yeah. armor, it does, <laughs> uh, the armor rating will block it. Anybody else with five attacks other Why than Why do you same? hate me? No. I hate all of you. Not you. I don't care about you. Ah. <laughs> all right. Because, again, it's been going straight for him. And let's see, action. Let's see, action five. So shotgun, shotgun does this guy have? Eventually, uh, yeah, it's, yeah, this is this is shot three. He's got five of this one. So it's good. So, let's fire shot number four. And what the hell? Headshot, yeah, that's probably better altogether. Hey, uh, 15. Now I'm gonna dodge that shit. Oh man, a 14. Alright, headshot times two damage. Here we go. Alright, alright, all together for the points, please. Uh, 1938. Uh, and since that is above his PP, I'm sure that will, uh, that, that's less than more than likely a stun. He'll need to make a, uh, I failed. That is action five Boom! Oh, sorry. I have two! <laughs> it will not be me. 16. Eight. Nine. This little bastard's got a 17. Or do I have to roll individually? Oh, no. Just, it, it's 17. Yeah, crap, oh, man. yeah. No, just roll one to crawl. Son number one is angry. Angry that you're killing his little brothers. He's gonna try to claw you. A 10. 25. Mm. Number two. Same thing. Ah! <laughs> 16. It missed. <laughs> Are we oh, going that to back me? and forth again? Yeah, it's just your turn. Yeah, it would not be your turn. Oh, yeah, it's same thing. I'm just going to go with the K bar. You're going to stab him. Stab. Stabby stab. Uh, natural 20 no! plus 6. Holy crap, a natural 20. You don't have to add in any more bonuses than you have to do this unless he rolls a natural 20. You got it. I did not. Natural 20s, you got a 5% chance of defending. Let's see again. So, 16 plus any bonuses uh, for the 20. No. Okay, so 16, 32. 32. Now, you're going to take a wolf, so you can break the knife. No! Ah, come on, break. And two seconds. I have. I should have this written on my written on my screen, and I don't. This happens more than you think. Here we go. We're in the hunting okay, hut. Okay, here it is. Every time. So yeah, what I'm getting at here for those of you that are listening, there is a supernatural damage and hand weapon ability that, when wielding a hand weapon such as swords, clubs, knives, uh, let's see here. A supernatural being or someone that can inflict um, such high damage like uh, Zia over here can do, uh, the weapon is in danger of breaking when wielded by something with such strength. Uh, let's see here. So if it does more, let's see, uh, you're going to have to play the one d six plus fourteen. Uh, no, it's always one d six plus fourteen. Okay. Anytime you do three three times the damage that you know beyond the max damage of that weapon, you need to roll a percentage dice. And if you happen to roll a one through thirty percent, that weapon breaks. Oh, you right. definitely went above three times. Break that off of my goofy ass. Fifty one. What'd my you say? Evil, creepy, goofy ass. 
So if you rolled a thirty percent or less, it would your knife would have broke. Which is okay. That's good. So I'm gonna yeah, twist it and drag it down what? your spine. Wait, wait, wait. That's, that's next turn. <laughs> that's next action. I love your enthusiasm. I tried. You tried to sneak one in there, did you? All right. Suka. All right, Zane. Your your evil little fish man is had to is stunned. He is stunned. I have one shot left in this thing. Might as well put it good use. Swallow the barrel. I say headshot, so I will not hit it unless I get defeated. Um, I'm stunned. Do I get defensive actions? Uh. No, you do not. Convenient. You're looking for 12. Alright, it's gone. Cooey. Cass. Bring it. Called Claw Rake to the face. I'm going to parry it. A 14. Damn it. That's a 12. A 14. Nine. Did I get his face? Uh, and so you made a call shot to his face? You yes. Said, you need a 12 or higher to, uh, to deal with oh, the bonuses. Yeah. If he did not bury it, yeah, that's right. Right to the face. That's a double damage. I'm going to get some little scars on you. It's a double damage? And in the head, yes. Oh, shit. If it's a headshot, it's double damage. So sorry. Uh, 16 points to the face. So 16 off your SDC. And does okay. that take you to hit points? Okay. I think it's worthy of a good scar. A little scar. Hmm. Okay, well, maybe I can fucking get <laughs> well, Peter. Yeah, he's not done yet. Oh, yeah, that's your turn. My turn? Yeah. Alright. You just got slashed across the face, uh, Cass. Pissed. I'm gonna respond. I'm gonna shoot him in the face with my Beretta. You will need a 12 or higher to do this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Should have went for the bomb. Again. Number six. This one, it, it now, when we left off, you rammed it up against the wall with your hammer, so it's still connected to him. It would still be attached. That yeah. is going to be a bite to the throat, then. Oh yes. <laughs> your uh, your helmet would have a uh, would have an armor rating of twelve, and as we discussed before, it's just a big black hole. Yeah, I got to 19. If you can't specifically, if you can't Wait, your name's Rambo Tep, right? It hits. Just deuce, don't worry about it. It hits. Deuce, I got to, deuce to the parry. If I can. <laughs> so to the neck. <laughs> There's going to be some blood loss involved yeah, in this one. Your jugular fucking blood. arterial splatter up against the hunting lodge wall. <laughs> Can you be Kurt LaDouche? <laughs> My brothers. All right, let's do a little damage. Is there a multiplier here? You probably uh, no, just told me. No, but it's all direct to hit points. <clears throat> and blood loss for those two Seven points to hit points. <laughs> so, uh, and this, generally the GM is, uh, I, I usually do this myself. Uh, you'll make a note with your own person that he's got blood loss at the end of his round. Where he needs to, where he's gonna start suffering hit points loss. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it took me. So oh, I get it. <laughs> He's like, what? Was oh yeah. <laughs> There's blood. Oh, All right, that brings us to action two. Peter, you gonna blood do anything? Time. Action he, one. He can't see you. <laughs> I know where the fire is, right? Yeah. Yeah. You're yeah. still attached to me. Yeah, I am. <laughs> yeah, I'm going right for the fire. <laughs> What are you going to do? Jump in it. Yeah. All right. <laughs> no. Is your suit expandable? Expandable? Uh, it's fine. No, it's, it's, wool. it's fine. Besides your helmet, I don't think the rest of it's is wool. You're naked? <laughs> it's wool. It's, it's wool. It'll, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's Actually, flame retardant now. I'm going to run right to Zeal. Oh. Mm-hmm. He's got a knife hanging right out of his back. And this is my last action, and your action. 
Okay. Planning. Yeah, I'm just running. Round two. Well, we are on action. All right. Sun number one is going to bite you in the boob. Kinky. It's, it's getting not. Uh, it's getting. Uh, She's very so muscular, so there's not a whole lot there. Well, they got a big mouth, so they got a fart <laughs> target. They do have a big. They're, wide they're mouth fighting there. dirty now. A twelve. <laughs> they just bit my tit. I got the called got shot. Bit. Uh, a bite does 2d6. Uh, didn't. What's your armor rating? I don't know. Yeah, uh, I think it was 10. 10. Oh, yeah. All right. 13. That goes to a regular hit point. That goes to your SDC. SDC. But you are bleeding? Yeah. Uh, blood loss rules of starting to get pretty bad. And number two is going to try to scratch you in the shin. Uh, got a, uh, a, if I'm called shot, I missed. 20! Oh, oh yeah, called for shot called shot, shin, but, um, yeah. uh, for called shot, you need a 12 all through with bonuses all together. Your turn. One of them's still attached to your chest, flailing about with yeah. his little evil fish tail like slapping you in the face. I want to do a demon punch. Sure. Get Can off I do that? my tit. Duh. Oh, see, that, that one. I don't yeah, need see, a I, nipple. I'm kind of like, I, you know, I, I would almost say, because, well, the demon punch. <laughs> You've got two of them. It's just a turn, because you, you can also use it in the form of, like, a kick or whatever else. So I suppose, in theory, you could kind of do one of these things. You kind of squish his head like a pimple. I, I, I'd allow it. <laughs> okay, I'm doing it. Do I need to, is that in here? Or? No, you'll still need to do the strike, because this thing's still thriving, and, you know, Riding and the Ten. Ten all together. Doesn't go over the armor class. Does not. I'll just flip it I'm off. sorry, armor rating. Armor rating, armor class, it's the same idea. Damn it. Zeke? Alright, so yeah, Zane, uh, I have to take an action to drop my shotgun and pull out the, uh, the, the slugger now as I'm looking for you. This is going to need help more. So I'm seeing Peter running her direction. And, Cass, how you feeling over there? Froggy. I'm okay. Alright, because that's the case. She's got a couple of them over here, and he's got one running right at her. So I'm seeing these two is where I need to go. Yeah, go help Zia. So my action is heading that direction while dropping a shotgun, picking up the and uh, are pulling my, uh, my my slugger out. I'm ready to do this. And that's my action. Sun number five is going to bite at Cass's groinal area. <laughs> He's obsessed with Jimmy Kimmel. I'll say, yeah, uh, Arm has got a weird obsession with Jimmy Kimmel. <laughs> I missed. I'm going to parry. You don't have to. You missed. I probably missed. <laughs> I mean, I love your enthusiasm. I was ready. It got air. Got air. Yep. All right, I'm going to shoot it. Mm, I'm going to aim straight for the chest. It's well, right, it's actually, right you between your legs. Shot, I'm just going to shoot him. Yeah, yeah. Anytime, anytime you just do a standard shot, it's always considered main body or doing All right. chest All right. area. Yep. So you do not need All right, I'm going to shoot him with my Beretta. Unless you're like, I'm going for a hard shot. That's different. <laughs> we haven't determined if these things have genitalia, so I can't shoot it. There are nuts. boys and girls. That is a that is actually a term though. As far as I can tell you, that since these things are not wearing clothes, no, there are no sex organs yep. upon this. All thing. right, so I'm just gonna shoot them. Fishman it, has nards. Fishman has no nards. It's kind of like the cock mating ritual. Yeah, four the eggs. <laughs> oh, for, uh, you uh, to and, uh, to shoot, you need to get a minimum of eight with bonuses <laughs> to, to hit with a uh, to hit with a modern card. Great. Fire with modern weapon. Great. I'm, uh, I'm gonna. This I know what I'm gonna going to do for weird. my next action. All right, Peter. It's Peter. on you. It's got one more try before you get it killed. It's Come going on, to try Peter. to bite you again, right in the neck, right so in the right in the breath hole. I need a twelve. Help me, Zia! Help me! Help me! Oh, help me, help me, help help me a help natural one. Help me, help me. I need help myself. Does he trip? Going backwards. <laughs> Why wow, you're the one running? 
no. He's, this thing's clung to you last oh, night. Maybe because Peter's so clumsy, he's going to trip. And you're going to land right on that hammer, right through you. <laughs> that's that not for the GM. 17. That is for the GM, in this case, to determine, since uh-huh. that's his monster. So 17. That's, you're going to fall to the floor? Yep. And try to... Well, yeah, okay, so... Him. Unless he decides to fling himself off, I don't think, yeah, that's... He tries to jump off you at the last moment. He would probably realize, yeah, holy crap. But he rolls another natural one! (laughs) Your dice have been uh, been pretty awesome tonight. Yeah, this is just fucking amazing. (laughs) (laughs) The the GM approves of the current GM's dice. Roll some damage. How does it feel, Tim? (laughs) (laughs) It's eight. Yep, so that would be uh, double, would be double, so 16. Bye bye, fish boy. Oh, that one's still up. Well, oh, fuck that. Of course You're it's still up. You're getting there. Yeah. I'm just gonna not. Yeah, I'm keeping track of hit points. <laughs> right? Yeah, I don't have no paper in front of me. I do you you attack it 50 head. times. I, it my head. I, I, I got it. It's still it. up. It's in my you head. can trust me. Fine. Silver Dragon only has 15,000 hit points, but I'm going to keep track of those in my head. <laughs> All right. Just like you do on Skyrim. Round number three. <laughs> Zia, what are they going to do to you now? I already got one on my boob. All right. One of them, number one, is going to try to do a leap attack onto your neck. He's latching on. He's latching on. <laughs> it missed. <laughs> number number two is gonna try to claw you in the just claw you. <laughs> it got a four. <laughs> All right, so the one that's attached to my chest, I just want to take my knife straight down on oh, him. Great. Admit, admit. Oh, okay, that one is still yeah, that's still uh, yeah. I think it's still clinging to me in my hand. <laughs> it's still latched on. To- it's going to try to dodge off of you. That doesn't matter, because I rolled a two. Oh. Well, it only if you're rolling a two. Oh, that's right. It's, uh, like, uh, it's ten. It's, yeah, it didn't it have to, right. because it's got armor, but it forgot about that, so it was scared, and it dodged <laughs> well, off of you. Saying, it did dodge, but it's GM off of you. Rolled, okay, so I didn't hit it, but the creature it's off. Instinctively ducked. All right, hold on. And he is no longer latched. Atva Lee. <laughs> Atvali Suka. Fuck off, bitch. Zane. Uh, Zane, Zane I got your name right. Yes, you did. It only took you uh, ten actions to bring that up. <laughs> no, eight actions. I apologize. Mm-hmm. Oh, as those, as the two, well, being as he's, he just fell on the one that's on the ground, he's rest. I'm not going to swing it back because it's a one. It's him instead. So I'm not going to swing at him because I might kill Peter. But she might still have a hit. Zane, well, actually, no, Zane, roll anymore. perception. I will roll a perception. What do we got? Uh, thirteen plus uh, four for seventeen. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, when you're looking around at the damage, you notice that uh, poor Cass, you can almost see his molars through his cheek. Yet his fish person seems unharmed. Ah, he said he was okay, but now that I know he's lying. Perception tells me Maybe otherwise. he's just overconfident. Okay. Well, in that case, I will, I will re, uh, I will change course and veer as I come running with a bat, which means you slip in blood, crack open your head, and die. And, uh, <laughs> oh, sorry. That means your creature does need to make a perception roll since it hasn't taken its attack, but otherwise will not see me coming, and it's a hit. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, roll to fourteen. Uh, Fourteen would it. actually be the uh, would be the, uh, the, the the requirement to see it. So yeah. you know I'm coming, so he could attack. But that also means that he does not attack him. You are welcome, Cass. Thank now you. Now that I know I can see your molars through your cheeks, I, I, I didn't I didn't notice that. So uh, I, I, I had to be the right uh, angle and mid running to see the. God, I cut the first leg. Either way, <laughs> I am getting this monkey off your back. So I will come at him swinging. Now you look like that picture you did of you. Yeah, like yeah, it's, uh, it's quite 14, accurate now. Not my best, right? Mm-hmm. Decent. Mm-hmm. 
It's gonna uh, it's gonna dodge. Fuck it. Right. It's wow. automatic. Got a fourteen to dodge. Fender wins. Fenders win ties. So yes, I uh, I swing get air. <laughs> that is my action three. Now, what did you say about Sun Number Five loses his action, or he gets to attack? Uh, since uh, well, he did an auto dodge, so yeah. actually he would have the choice now of attacking Cass or uh, or or Zane. Oh, he's gonna go after Zane this time. Okay. A claw to Zane. I guess I have it coming. Damn it! Uh, it was a five total. Five. Slip on the blood. Uh, See? It was <laughs> nine. Yeah, it was, it, was, it was a pretty piss poor roll, so. Cass, your action. Alright, I'm gonna try to shoot him again. Natural 20. What? Oh! Oh! Dick bag. Yell it! Oh, sorry, evil. You dick bag. He's a fish. I didn't oh, write that the children can talk. 15. <laughs> <laughs> Into its hit points. Peter, the one on you is kind of pinned against the floor. Against you? Is that what's going on? Kind of. I'm on top of him. I guess it's going to try to bite you. We can try. It's going to be a little hard because I'm up on top. It, uh, and he's still attached. He missed. And he, he missed yeah, the and neck. He would have no... Uh, yeah, since, the, uh, since we are in ground fighting, he has no, uh, he has no strike bonuses since he's on the bottom. Yeah. How does it feel what to be the do? bottom for I'm once? I'm trying to keep that mature, everyone. PG-13. I'm on top of him. I'm just going to try to... Since I'm holding <laughs> him down, I'm just going to kick him right in the ribs. You can try. All right. Might be more mean to Five. The ribs. Yeah, mean to the ribs. Like, I, I oh, didn't right even get over his armor. Really, uh, Did nothing. I'm going to keep trying it. I'm going to hold him down. <laughs> I feel somebody Don't else worry. If, if your molars start showing through your cheeks, I'll come help. Through Don't the mask, then you know it's a problem. <laughs> yeah, you know it's a problem. Look at me, man. You don't want to end up like me. It's round four. Suddenly, he sounds like Sylvester Stallone. Sun number one is out of attacks. Sun number two is going to try to claw you. Ooh, he got a 19. I failed. Oh, shit. Nine points of SD's, uh, nine points of damage. Oh. Yeah. Too late. Okay, so I he's over by me. There's two attacking me. Okay, I am going to attempt to stab the one attached to him with my knife. Yeah, go all the way through it. <laughs> oh my god, it's cocked. <laughs> well, depending on the gun. Cocked. Not even against its armor. Do I have a quit? Zane! <laughs> I, like, <laughs> I like totally quit. I'm out of here, man. <laughs> Screw you guys. I'm going home. <laughs> Zane? Uh, yes. Um, oh, yeah. I was trying to beat this thing into the hole. Well, keep at it. That, that is one. a natural 20. Yay! Can he dodge it? Can he dodge it? No. You know, he's going to feel it. Uh, 1d12. Oh, hell yeah. 1d12 plus 3. Gone. I rolled a 12. It's so dead. So 22, that makes it what, 44? Yeah, I heard oh, your big shit. numbers. It's dead regardless. Big vein! That was a real life saver. <laughs> I didn't want you to be like me. <laughs> Thanks, man. Uh, I can't believe you can see my mole or see my cheese, man. Cast your action. Okay. There's still... How close am I to Peter? Uh-uh. <laughs> I'm PG-13, I will not respond. Am I in the vicinity of Peter? What do you want to do? What are you trying to do? I want to shoot Peter's dude. Oh, you can have Oh, I can't. He's on the ground. He's on the ground, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah. That sounds like Shit. a trick shot. That no. sounds like a challenge. 
All right. Well, he said it's got to be. If you roll natural one <laughs> when you're that close to another party, it is the other party deal. Yeah, so I'm not going to do that. Um, <laughs> Take a chance. Just get right up close, put it to his head, and just let it go. All right. Go I, ahead, Gas. You can get You can do this. All right, so I'm going to go over to Peter's. The voice in your head is kind of telling you to do it. <laughs> I'm going to. I'm going to. Um, i got to pee for some reason. <laughs> I'm going to put nervous. my gun to the head. Roll the dice, Gas. And I roll a 19. Ah! Whoa! Nice shooting, Tex! Oh my lord, he's gonna... 15 points of damage. Dead! Woohoo! Nice. So what do we got left? Yeah, we got two the arms. ones yeah. I can't hit for nothing. <laughs> Why are you taking my kill? What are you doing? <laughs> well, Peter you're welcome. To, I get mad that people are kill stealing. Getting back to his feet, unfortunately. Oh, you're you're welcome. You're feet. welcome. Who's got Mia? five attacks? I do. Five. That would be uh, Thanks, Zia please. and Zane. The Z's no. have it. Okay, Zia. I am going to try telekinetic punch one more time because it's going so well. Zane. 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 Uh. Ten. Yeah, fail. Didn't even get over its nasty little supernatural fish armor. I'm gonna grill your fish armor. Oh wait, I, I am going to grill nice your singer. fish armor. <laughs> <laughs> nice catchphrase. Uh, Zane needs to ask the GM if, if this person will be singing right away or if they can actually. They are close right. enough. This isn't a huge. Kick him watch. in the fish balls. I will grill you. <laughs> I feel Duh. Uh, well, then Duh. I will grill you. And it doesn't know I'm coming since it's used as action. Cut you or into no, borscht. Action, so here you go. If he fries, he fries. Yeah. Altogether, it is uh, a 17 to get him. Yeah, sure, you got it. That was a good one. That was good, right? Yeah, yeah. that was a good one, Dolph. <laughs> <laughs> if he fries, he fries. Oh. Oh. <laughs> weird, uh, 14 over. Oh, it's still up. That's not wow! Funny. That is action five. That will bring us to really bleeding. Great. How do we do bleeding? Oh yes, those of you or those that are suffering from blood loss that are unable to raise a hand or two points to your hit points. Arrow. One point to your hit points. How do you bleeding when you're out of SDC? Uh, either when you run out of SDC or if you, you were you, you did have a neck. Off. You have a bite attack yeah. that yeah. makes you bleeding. Yep, your boobs. You're bleeding too. Yep. Yeah. At least mine's not embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Initiative for the next round. The fish have a 16. All two of them. Four. Yeah, five. Yeah, I got a four. Two, three. Sorry, three. I got a three. He's only good at rolling initiative, so that's fine. They're not close. But he can't roll for shit once he gets going into the, the battle. <laughs> into the battle. <laughs> Don't start talking shit or it'll jinx us. <laughs> He's still playing D&D. He's yeah, going for the lowest. Is, uh, yeah, it is it is one point of damage uh, at the... Uh, it is one point of damage every four rounds. Into hit points? Into, uh, directly to hit points. So you'll take one now, and then if you go another four rounds, you uh, action one, round three. Yes, uh, roll your initiative for Zane. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, all together, my initiative sucks tonight. Uh-huh. I have oh, yeah. five. All, all right, five. so, son number one is going to turn to Zane and try to claw him. What? A twelve. Fine. Sun number two. We'll try to slash claw at Zia. A fourteen. A fourteen. Eighteen plus eight is twenty-six. Damn it! <laughs> now you're not impressed. 
<laughs> See ya. <laughs> you can go. I recommend running away. Obviously, these things are going to overpower your group soon. <laughs> now who's talking shit? I tried to run away. They're blocking the door. I'll run after the sister. Is it my turn? It is your turn. Nice. Two left. One of them you could probably kill with a sharp glance. Which is the one? 23 to hit. I didn't call which one I was hitting. Probably whoever's closer. 19 to parry. You got it. You got it. We're going with number Oh, number two was attacking you. Yeah, one two shots when attacking. So I got 18 total. That's a serious loss. Die. And almost above your century. <laughs> and it is stunned. Suka. Kiwi. Z. Uh, oh yeah, the one that tried to, uh, the one that did a claw attack, I think he looks like he could do some good damage. I hope you hit yourself in the kneecap. That's what happens if you get a one. That's what if I'm running this, you yeah. hit yourself <laughs> in the kneecap. She says you break your kneecap. <laughs> but I didn't roll one, it's okay. We're All gonna to Rambo tap you. Altogether, I have 16. You shatter your own jaw, it really ah. hurts. <laughs> Now you don't like me. You don't like me, Zane. Hey, it's going to parry. <laughs> it does not parry. You right, make right. contact. Plus ten. Kill it. Uh, Sixteen altogether. You splatter it, and it all goes towards Zia. <laughs> <laughs> not fish my guts. Worst night. Evil, <laughs> supernatural, super stinky fish guts. Like Wednesday. <laughs> don't they just evaporate off the wall anyway? Eventually. Yeah, but until then, they stink like ass. Hey, Zen, you like? <laughs> Cass, what are you going to do? There's do one go left. Again. I'm going to uh, <laughs> shoot you. Yeah. Eight. Oh, I couldn't do it. <laughs> no. Bounced off a slow supernatural fish eye. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> Peter, come in for the kill. Your turn. What are you going to do? I'm going to start grabbing specimens. <laughs> They're almost all dead. I'm going to start grabbing pieces before they all disappear. All right. Sounds good. Next round. Taking pictures. Round number two. Sun number one. Sun number one is afraid. It's got these two muscular people in front of it. So it's going to make a leap attack. At Cass. <laughs> <laughs> it's high tailing it away from you two. I, I see it. Okay. Oh, snap! 18. 21. Yes. <laughs> Help! No. Help! Help! Help me! Help! 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 Please Absolutely, don't you don't are. Don't miss, please don't miss. See, if you're gonna make a leap attack, you better have it. Don't miss. Come on, Thea. Ah, damn it! You got it. That's a critical hit in the back. Eight. Eight. Good. It I'm connected. Not I'm not good. Yeah. I'm moving. It was trying to. It wanted you to fail, so it didn't. I'm not gonna die. Ooh, today. twenty. Yeah, you could have breathed on it hard, and it would have died. Splattered all over Cass. <laughs> <laughs> this is so gross. I'm going to market this. Its little Call arms it around fish. you, and it, it goes. <laughs> what? Uh, it was six plus fourteen. Baby, get the lip fuck off falls me, John, down baby. Under the ground. Get ah. off me, John, baby. For her, for her last, uh, her last attack, she needs to roll to see if she broke her knife again. Thirty. Roll, trying broke to roll it in Cass's. Broke it off in the I damn thing's ass. Broke it off in your jugular. Not mean. 
56. All right, All your right. K-bar is strong. And so are you. Duh. Pretty sturdy weapon. Oh, it's 9 o'clock. So that's okay. Yeah, put that thing in an industrial press. I think we need it. to keep fighting. Go. They are gone. No, the sister's still out there. But however, two of you are still bleeding. Fuck you. That's it. Oh. <laughs> I got first aid. Oh, that sister has had three rounds to get away. I run really fast. Where? <laughs> okay. Where do you run okay. to? Wherever it's Catholic splooshed since it is, all yeah, over. Since it is 9 o'clock. Well, okay. Nick, uh, yeah, Nick edited that. <laughs> we are going to end the show tonight with the uh, climactic battle no! coming to an end. Oh, no! The group... The group will need to, uh, you know, it looks like we'll need some uh, uh, first aid rules. You want five minutes? Ten more minutes. Ten more minutes? Yeah. I'm fine. That's good. Nick, edit here. Anybody? <laughs> All right. All Can right. I do my first aid yet? Yeah. <laughs> are, we run, are we running after <laughs> that thing? Because ten minutes tonight would equal an hour to get to that point next time we play, so. I think we're almost at a good stop. We just need a few more minutes to get there. Fair enough. Well, the first thing we'll need, uh, you were Does anybody samples. have first aid? I need a crime scene. Uh, I got first aid. I up with you earlier. I need a crime scene roll and a photography roll. Photography, odd six. Then your photography is spot on. First aid, 33. And I have a 60. So you are successfully patching up some wounds. Taking ourselves to catch a breather, then. Can I, can I do first aid, too? You may do first aid no. as well. We didn't get to your hit points. You're not permanently disfigured. No! God damn it, I gotta talk so I gotta keep talking like Stallone. Oh, I'm gonna love it then. You're disfigured, go ahead. You're disfigured. <laughs> Roll to see Half if you can tongue. help your, uh, your brain with the, with the molars over here. Hot nine. Wait, nine D. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, very you remembered role. that human semen is great at patching mouth wounds. Uh, oh. I gotta really? keep going. <laughs> human semen is great. What about no, no. fish semen? <laughs> I don't think I have. Uh, yeah, he's not having his first aid. It's really weird. That figures. See ya. Any first aids over there with you? I uh, have yoga trances, but I don't want to go into one because that fucker's getting away. Yeah. Well, yeah, you've got I'm plenty of hit points. He's Sorry. got plenty of hit points. I only thought about myself. Wait, wait, who needs immediate he's help? He's got, well, he's got blood loss rules uh, going on here. Uh, no. No, what's my armor? No. He never got blood oh. loss. No, never got, no he got he got a pretty good but gash, he's got, but he, he's, he's not, not even in us. Mine. You, but he's yep. patched up. Yeah. <laughs> he's got a bat. He got so some, you were taking he's applying pressure. She's running off. She's hauling ass. All right, see ya. In the hey, fish girl, I come so for to you. The children are nothing more than mounds or splatters of, sl- of smelly slime uh, on the ground and on our comrades. Zia, since you're the first to look, you looking out the pavilion doorway, the uh, t- looking for the creature that had run off uh, moments before. A few hundred feet away, near the end of the clearing, you see it. Its arms outstretched, but only for a moment. Once it lowers its arms, it turns its entire body to look back at you all, lacking the articulation in its neck to do so, uh, before, tu- uh, uh, before turning back to run. But after a step or two, it vanishes, as if it entered an invisible room. Zane, behind you, who watches this happen, shouts, Holy crap, y'all. It's a dimensional door. We can go home. I'm running straight for where the fish disappeared. I'm running into the door. Hmm. Zane takes a moment to pick through John's belongings, selecting his handgun and Fuck the him. strange disc John had found earlier in the Fuck day. Fuck him! Bye, John. I'm sorry what I couldn't douche. save you, buddy. Excuse me? What handgun? Do you have one? No. He what was uh, defenseless at that point. He had a stick. He had a. Uh, <laughs> what would, uh, no, what would look a like stick. a personal possession that John would carry then? That, that's ultimately what we're looking for. Pills on him? Yeah, um, what's probably the most personal looking thing that's on him? <laughs> There's a on specific him, huh? reason for it. Gee, would it be a burner phone? No, not at all. Yeah, not a burner. Oh, yeah, this is very boy. personal, sentimental value to me, this burner phone. Boy, he really didn't give a shit about my 
much. Um, is there anything there? Or we're going to go with... Um, yeah, he did ease his hoodie off. His lock picking set. Given to his, by his father. Oh, that would probably be concealed upon his body. What about your Seattle Mariners hat? If it's cause something concealed in a weird place, ultimately he's just trying to feel out for something that's a personal attachment. Yeah. He can take his phone. The real phone. He's got a field pawn. He can place. roll a D. He, he's got a 33% chance to take the right one. Take a testicle. He's right, always attached to it. Chance to just take it. Oh, attach this a old life. Zero four. Zero, zero, four. Oh, all right. Which is cool because that means you're going to get some of the jobs of slavery. You'll never get it. No, not. Jesus, where's your mind? Never. So that's what uh, that's what you two are. Uh, who, well, actually, not here's. I heard Zia was already heading towards the doorway. Uh, Cass is looking for the doorway now. And here, what's up with you? I'm looking Last for something in the in the room. Wards. What I'm are you looking for? Pieces, and I'm gonna go grab that bow and arrow that was on the floor. Come on, Peter! Before it closes. I need a souvenir. Hold on. Nobody's gonna believe this. This is astro like. Extra planar. We need to take this with us. Have it. You right, took just... pictures of tree monster. Am I already through the door? It's fine. <laughs> I need something else. You will more hard, more through concrete. The door, yes. And at this point, oh you God, are you have successfully God. entered the doorway. And I grab John's body and I drag him behind me. Come on, Come on Peter. <laughs> it's yeah, John, Zane, man. Zane, uh, yeah, Zane will interject on that. He, uh, he states uh, uh, the body comes apart about mid torso. That's fine. Just rips into. I just it. need the head. <laughs> We just need the head. <laughs> we gotta have some proof that he died. We have to have some burial. It would be only right. Saying, uh, I, I, I don't, I don't know. I mean, we're gonna. How are we gonna explain this? They're gonna think we're the ones that killed him. Maybe you put your head in his helmet. Oh, in his helmet? In your helmet. <laughs> Yeah, I guess you're right. We should probably leave him here because uh, yeah, nobody's really looking for this guy. Well, nope. I'm not saying we leave him here permanently. So you know, that's why you can I come back him. here. Well, that's what one day we can find a way back. I got his phone. Maybe we can give him a proper burial. But right now, we don't have the time for this. That door can ah, close any moment. Fine, let's go. Come on, Peter. I don't want to leave him either. But am I through the door if yet? That door closes. The next All time right. we're getting out of here is if one of you two explode. Mm. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> I'm running through it. Am I through the door? Oh, my K bar, my hammer! I forgot my hammer. That's right, thirty nine ninety five at S Mart. We'll find <laughs> Shop smart, shop S Mart. Yes, as you are about to exit, you hear your name being called behind you. I'll be back. I promise. Let's see. I'll give experience for that. Uh, yeah, yeah. Are you looking behind you? Yep. So yeah, because yeah, even even before even before you look, you already knew. I'm giving XP. That was a good call. Yes, you see, Chivan and his elders are all standing together near the pavilion, and all of them are looking at you. And Chivan looks uh, mortified and ready to cry, realizing that you're about to break your vow to help him. No, we'll be back. I promise. And after that, uh, yeah, I'm assuming you exit. I'm out for Chiba that way. <laughs> you are. All right. Have you exited, Peter? Yes. Dr. Corey. I'm running. Zane will follow right behind. And this is then how we will end this particular episode. <clears throat> dun, dun, dun. After everyone has entered the invisible doorway with a quick shimmer, it dies out. And Chiba looks mortified and forsaken. One of the elders walks behind him, placing an ethereal hand upon his ethereal shoulder. Do not grieve, Chiban, for Cass will return for you one day. Chiban looks back to him. Will he? The elder replies, oh yes, he has to. He swore to break your curse, and your curse is a powerful one. It protects itself and takes promises to be broken seriously. Until the curse is broken, your curse is now his to bear as well. End of episode. What a Everyone, thank you for listening tonight. That was intense and a little weird with, with uh, Arnie in the uh, the GM seat there for the moment. You know, he, he went roots that, that I would not have, you know, obviously, but you know, at the same time, it was highly entertaining.
And that's what we do here. We have fun. Uh, so since we've gone over in our time, I, I, I wish you all a, uh, a good night and good mental health and, um, and take the plan, the plan B. So this is Steve. Nick. Kirk. Arn. Shannon. And we wish you all a good night. Bye, everybody. And cut. She's giving me a handy, but she's just smashing it now.